We may have finally done it. We've been looking for the perfect windshield protection film for literally years. Expel has been designing one for literally years. As is typical with Expel, they don't want to release a product that they weren't super confident in. They are with this one now, and we get to test it out. So we've been using it on cars now for the last couple of months. The installation process is very similar to some of the other soft shell types. I think they're called TPU. Uh, versus like the harder window film style. And that's what the guys are working on right back here. So I bought a new car, a 2019 GT3 RS, and it does not have windshield film on it yet. So there's a couple rock chips on it already. The car does have a little over 9,000 miles, but the windshield's not cracked. So we're gonna make sure we get film on that thing right away, because as most of you guys probably know, I like to drive my cars. As far as I've been able to observe with the limited amount of cars that we've done with this, we've probably done 10 cars total across the couple shops and I've seen a handful of them in person. This film, I haven't seen it dry yet. In my opinion, has a little bit of distortion, but like you have to really know that you're looking for it. That's, it's a pet peeve of mine. I'm, I'm always looking for that distortion in windshield film. We learned early on though, some of that distortion was actually due to the install. Um, there's things that you have to do to prep the windshield correctly and if you don't do that the adhesive can kind of smear and it presents itself as distortion. When I say distortion it's almost like you're wearing the wrong prescription eyeglasses. That's kind of what it looks like through certain parts of the windshield. And some films are really bad with that. This is probably the best that I've seen uh, especially of the soft shell type. The hard shell ones you can get a really nice view with hardly any distortion. The problem is they're so hard to install there's usually other defects. With this film, it's easy enough to install that you can get a really, really good install, and that distortion is so minimal. I think this is the answer. Plus, Expel is giving it a warranty. So it's got a 12-month, 12 12,000-mile 12, warranty. Pretty cool. So as I get into the car, guys, um, if you're picking your vehicle up from a windshield protection film install, the first thing you're going to do is freak out. Just like regular window film, if you pick it up an hour or two after it's installed, it's super distorted. There's a ton of moisture underneath the film. Um, that's gonna turn into little air pockets, and, or I'm sorry, water pockets, moisture, big bubbles. Those will dry out. So right now, I really can't get an accurate idea of how distorted or not distorted this is gonna be because right now it all looks really bad because the moisture's still in there drying out. So um, in a day or two, we'll have our answer as for the clarity of this film. When we first installed it, I wasn't sure how it was going to dry, what the distortion was gonna look like, if there would be any. And I'm here to tell you that I've driven the car a good bit now. It's obviously fully cured three weeks later. It is freaking clear, like crystal clear, clear. Um, hardly any distortion at all. And I mean, I really have to be looking for the distortion. I, if you didn't know there was film on here, you absolutely would not know that there's film on here when you're driving the car. So um, as far as we can tell right now, it checks all the boxes. As far as longevity is concerned, that's still up for debate. I have driven the car in the rain, consequently it's raining right now, um, a, a lot, and I get no wiper chatter, nothing like that. The wipers work just fine. Um, they do recommend switching to silicone wiper blades. I haven't had to do that. It seems to be seems to be fine, so it hasn't scratched it up yet. I wouldn't expect it to after three weeks. So the windshield protection film is installed, but as always, it's really not worth anything unless it actually protects the windshield. Unfortunately, I can't answer that question for you yet. We promise we will do a review of this in a few months, especially after racing season next year, after we track this car a few times, and let you know just how well the Expel paint protection film, I'm sorry, the Expel windshield protection film, not used to saying that yet, held up over time.